So happy new year everyone, um, it is 2012, this is my first video in 2012, I've been on YouTube now for well, say seven years, um, but the videos that I've made have only been to 2007. So, technically, yeah. Anyways, um, just wanted to actually make that kind of a video. Uh, I was watching Raw a, a couple weeks ago, uh, last week actually, seeing Kane come back. And, you know, it's kind of interesting because you have Kane and John Cena who are going to be feuding together and much is really fresh and new. I can't wait to see what's in store because it's gonna be awesome, you know. I think John Cena needs another feud, another feud to take the focus off the WWE belt. Now if we can get Randy Orton, to, well actually that's another thing too because now Randy Orton is uh, gone now. He has been gone for Oh, uh, a long week. They say, oh, he's gonna be out for six months, but I doubt it. But, another the case if the, if, uh, he can not get a title shot. And then the Royal Rumble is coming up. Um, I'm hopefully gonna do a video about that with my predictions. And of course, we all know that Chris Jericho came back last night. You know, it's like I say, you know, it's like they all say, eh, there's a lot of build up but no payoff. And Chris Jericho coming back, he didn't say really anything. And he just basically, you know, it's kind of weird. But, you know, that's him. And, uh,. So, I don't know what's going to happen. They said there is going to be a feud between him and uh, CM Punk in the near future. I'm not sure how that's going to go down. I did like the get-up, though. So, that was pretty cool. So, yeah, Rock kicked off. And then, just a little quick one down there. Yeah, looks kind of cool. So... John Cena came out and he calls out um, Kane. As I said before, this is how it's going to go down. And uh, yeah, basically, John Cena is like, I'm going to enjoy this. I'm going to be the same person that I am, blah, blah, blah. I think, yeah, I think we're finally going to get it set up for. A John Cena heel turn, but I'm not sure how that's going to go down. Then uh, Daniel Bryan took on Cody Rhodes and finally won the match. Won a match. Daniel Bryan finally won a match. But I think that's awesome. Since he's become world champion, a couple weeks ago, he finally won a match. Last night. Then Wade Barrett took on Santino Morella. Um, Wade Barrett's, uh, well, Wade Barrett's, uh, a wrecking machine, so of course he was going to take out Santa, you know. And Seamus took on The Miz, and, uh, Our Truth came out and wiped out The Miz. So now Our Truth is a face, which, I don't know if that's a good idea. Like I said, I, I really enjoyed The Awesome Truth, but of course that failed quickly and so I don't know what's gonna happen but we'll see I mean that's kind of how it is Dolph Ziggler took on CM Punk and that match was a count out 
and Bella Twins, they took on Kelly Kelly versus Eve. Really no interest in the Diva Division, but, you know, for what it's worth, you know, I guess it was okay. And then, of course, the long-awaited return of Chris Jericho. And if you saw the, the video in the beginning, that wasn't much. The guy comes out, he looks great, but he doesn't say nothing. Whether he was too emotional to speak, I don't know. He has been away from the ring for a while. So, the only question now is, what's going to happen? Is he going to have a feud with CM Punk? Is he going to take out The Undertaker at WrestleMania 28? Uh, it's hard to say at this point. So anyways, hope everyone had a happy holiday and a happy new year. And hopefully... I'll make more videos and yeah, I'll hopefully make no uh, more videos that nobody will watch. Okay, bye.